Morning. Morning. Oh, the cuddle. I like a cuddle. Can you say welcome back to our channel? Hello. <laughs> oh, no. And where are we going today? Can you say Hertfordshire? Hertfordshire. And because it's Baby Ocean's birthday tomorrow. Birthday. Baby Ocean. Can you sing happy birthday? Happy birthday to Osha. <laughs> Good girl, that was so nice. Nice. You sing so beautifully. Pretty. Laura, sing happy birthday. Happy birthday to Osha. Look, Daddy's naked. <laughs> Daddy's naked. Ew. Ew, Daddy's naked. Yeah, so, as Alora said, welcome back to our channel, and we are going to Hertfordshire this weekend. So, tomorrow, you're really hogging the light here. Tomorrow is Ocean's birthday, who you'll probably know, Sydney and Ocean. Um, so, we are going up to Hertfordshire, which is about two hours from us, but we're staying in, in an Airbnb tonight just to, like, make the most out of the trip and not have to do the journey, like, twice in one day. So that's what we're doing today. We're leaving at 10, and I don't know what the time is, but it's probably about 7. And I completely forgot that the clocks were going... Did the clocks go back or forward? The clocks went forward, so when Alora woke up at 6 or 10 to 6, I was like, oh, okay, great, like, it's time to get up. And then I looked at the oven and it said, like, quarter past five. And yeah. Bam, bam, bam. And then I realised I could have got an extra hour of sleep, but we were up then, so I can't put her back down once she's awake. <laughs> Say happy Easter. Happy Easter. I actually can't wait to see what food is near the Airbnb. That's probably what I'm most excited for at the moment, to look on Uber Eats and see what I could order for dinner. I did see they've got some like burger and wing places and then they've got quite a few like Japanese places, which I would probably prefer, but I know Dre would prefer burger and wings. So uh, yeah. we're gonna have to run, whoa, whoa, whoa. flip a coin. What are you trying to say? Oh yeah, I want wings, oh, don't I? Oh, where's my face? Oh yeah, you love Look chicken so much. Jesus Christ. Oh, love chicken so much, oh yeah. Fried chicken, man, yeah. I'm hungry, so we're probably gonna get a coffee and a toasty on the way. <laughs> it's the first time I've talked about this. But it's, it's mand mandatory, mandatory, yeah. mandatory. It's mandatory to get a coffee and a toasty when you go on a long journey. But anyway, that's enough for the intro because I'm waffling on. But people actually keep messaging me saying how they want longer vlogs. So that's why I'm trying to drag this out. But it's obviously, it's only going to be a two-day vlog. So I don't know how long I'm going to be able to make this. But I will try my best. Dre will put his waffle on and... Dre will put his waffle on. But yeah, anyways, let's go to Hertfordshire. Also, look how cute this little gift wrap is for Ocean's present. We got her a little pink mini backpack with her name on it, because Alora's got one from the same company and we use it every time we go out, so very handy. And then we got her the Commotion in the Ocean book to go in it, because you know, Commotion in the Ocean. Wait, did you get it? But that book literally reminds me of like growing up in primary school because I don't know if anyone else used to read that book in primary school but but I did. Right, I'm trying to talk quite quietly because Alora is fast asleep in the back. Oh my god, she's literally just... Can you hear her snoring? She's just... Oh my god, I'm actually scared. She's just getting over her, like the end of her cold, so her snoring has like been crazy. Um, she's been like coughing in her sleep, bless her. But we are—we've got about an hour left of the journey, so we're about halfway through the journey. We've just stopped at Cobham Services. If you watch my Centre Parks vlog, you'll know that anytime I pass Cobham Services, it's a must. Like I have to go in because they've got this place there called El Mexicana. I've, said that the most British way that I possibly can um, but they do such nice burritos so Dre has gone to get me a pulled pork burrito and then whatever he wants and then get Alora some chicken and chips for when she wakes up 
but yeah, we knew that she was either going to fall asleep in the car or have to have a nap as soon as we got to the Airbnb because her nap is anywhere between 11 and 12, half 12. So the time now is half 11, so I literally bang on. And obviously me stupidly forgetting about the clocks going forward. She was obviously up an hour earlier than she needed to be, so she probably knackered, bless her. Um, but yeah, I'm absolutely starving. And the journey so far has been fine. Like traffic has basically been non-existent. Touch wood, so I'm not gonna now jinx that. But also I've parked so close to this car, so I'm really hoping that these people don't come back before Dre does, because I'm like, do you want me to move? I'm in the space, so you know, not breaking any laws, but it's common parking courtesy not to park this close to someone. I just couldn't be asked to move at the time. We've just got here. Wow. Well, we got here probably like 20 minutes ago now. So let's give you a little tour of the pad. So, obviously got bathroom shower in there. Alora's reading the books that are down there. This is the kitchen area into the lounge. Little breakfast bar. This sofa is so comfortable as well. And then this is the bedroom. Obviously we're all probably gonna be sharing the bed tonight, so. So yeah, that's it, just a cute little place. I'm not exaggerating when I say this, but I've just been bit by a spider, haven't I? Yeah. I don't know why you're rolling your eyes, because you know it's true. This is my dad's teddy from when he was younger, so we're going back about 40 years, maybe more than that. Um, and he let Alora have it yesterday when we were around his house. Somehow, between then and now, a spider ended up on it. And it was only literally about this big. It was tiny, but it was like a bit green and red, like a weird looking spider. Anyway, I didn't know it was on it. So I've gone to like, oh, he go rah rah and snuggle it, yeah? And then I felt something like sharp on my cheek. You started feeling really wheezy, didn't you? Shut up, let me finish. <laughs> I felt something sharp on my cheek, so I looked at it thinking like, what is that? Is that a stick or something on it? And I saw the spider, so then obviously I freaked out, threw it in the sink and... <laughs> but... This is where it bit me, and you can't even deny that it's red, so you know I'm not lying. I'll keep you guys updated on that, or Dre might have to finish the vlog because I've been hospitalised, but you'll find out, so... Right, update. We don't really understand what's going on, because there's a TV in here and there's a TV in here. One remote that was on the side. So look, I'm putting this TV on. So that's turned on. It's not even gonna do it now, is it? I'm gonna look like a right idiot. Yeah. But even, even, right, even if it doesn't do it, we turned this TV on and then the TV in the bedroom also turned on to something different. And then I turned the bedroom TV off and that TV turned off. So it was like, you had to have both on at the same time. The remote sort of works for both of them. But now I look like an idiot because it's not done it, so never mind. Right, we've just come back from the shop, so let's do a haul. We've got some... <laughs> the football's about to start and he can't put his bet on. <laughs> um, we've got some croissants for breakfast in the morning. Also, completely forgot it was Easter Sunday, so literally none of the shops were open. But luckily, car was only down the road and that was open. For what reason is this not working? And then I've got like some cereal as well, just in case Alora doesn't want the croissants or we can see a bit of something else as well. These literally were my childhood. My nan used to have these all the time. And then we've got apple tizer, apple juice, milk, even though there's like little sachets of milk here for the tea and coffee and that, I just got some just in case. And then milkshake, because Alora's been loving a bit of milkshake recently. Magic stars. And then I'm not gonna say this out loud because Alora's gonna want it, but her favourite thing ever. And then also a gingerbread man for Laura. And then that's all we've got. We're gonna order an Uber Eats takeaway, as I said earlier in this vlog tonight. So that's all we really need. Excuse me. What are you doing? Alora and I managed to have a nap for about an hour and a half. How long did we sleep for an hour and a half? Yeah. We napped for about an hour and a half. She fell asleep on the sofa, so I took that as my chance and got into bed with her. And now we've ordered some dinner. We ordered from this like piri piri place, so we got some piri piri chicken on the way. And I've got a milkshake as well. I was craving a milkshake, so yeah. Hopefully that's nice. All right, so our peri peri chicken is finally here after like 
an hour and a half because they couldn't find the place twice. So, we've got chicken and cheese quesadilla. Chicken wings and chips. Hot wings. And then we just got Laura some mash and chicken that she's eating on the floor. I got this like mojito, sparkling mojito drink and Dre got sparkling strawberry. And then I got a banana milkshake but I don't really like it that much. Because it's made with real bananas and I like it when it's like artificial bananas, you know. Um, yeah, I don't really like the chunks of banana in it so, great. Brush your teeth. You brush your teeth. <laughs> right, water. Oh wow, all clean. Can you clean your mouth? Wipe it. One more. One more dry. <laughs> Can you say night night? Hey night. Oh money. You got clean teeth. Cheese. Good morning. Morning. <laughs> it's crazy. Saturday. Saturday? It's Monday. Monday. And what are we doing today? Nonu. No, we're not seeing Nalu or Nonna. Nonu. No, we're going to see Baby Ocean. <laughs> she didn't even end up going to bed last night till about half eight and she still woke up at half six. But we're just watching Spongebob right now. Dre is um, doing his business on the toilet. But yeah, the plan for today is check out at 11. And then I think the party is like 30 minutes from here. So make our way over that way and probably just grab some food while we wait. Because it doesn't start till 12. But you might fall asleep in the car, mightn't you? Rara. <laughs> You're scary. <laughs> oh my god. Wake up. No. Back to sleep. How do you beep? We're ready. So ready. Alora has literally been a menace this morning, like really, really bad, just dropping non-stop. So anyone with tips on how to sort out two-year-old tantrums, we're gonna go in a minute. Look. Should we go outside? Do you want to Do go, you want go outside? outside? Should we change your nappy and go outside? Yeah. 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 So checkouts in literally five minutes. So we're just gonna go now, um, get down there to where the party is, and hopefully there's somewhere that we can get a coffee, food, whatever, or hopefully Laura sleeps in the car, which is probably our best bet, because hopefully she'll wake up in a better mood. <laughs> Cheese! Oh, yeah, they <gasps> Ra Rara, wait, baby. Ra Rara, Rara. Ra. <laughs> Happy birthday, Bibi Ocean. We've got a plate full of food in hand for this two and a half hour journey. So yeah, let's go home now. Rara, sing it.
<laughs> now we're home, Ra Ra. We're home. Dre ended up driving the rest of the half, the rest of the half, half, half the way home. home. Cause um, I wanted to munch. Yeah, I got some, I got some chicken noodles from, from the service station. So I wanted to eat them. Obviously you can't really eat them when you're driving. So yeah, we've just made it home. So that literally wraps up this vlog. There's nothing else left to do or say. I'm going home to do a massive pile of washing now. So love that. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out.